Bless up, bless up my viewers. Welcome back to the channel. Watch, like, share, comment and subscribe. Man stopped to death outside Sentence nightclub identified. A man who was stopped to death during an altercation in the vicinity of an exotic nightclub in Runaway Bay Sentence on Monday morning has been identified. The deceased is Christopher Raymond of a Mount Edge Comba address in the parish. Police report that Raymond and three other men were stopped during an altercation at about 4 a.m. It's reported that the man were stopped following a dispute outside a nightclub. Sources have informed the news that the security guard at the nightclub was among the wounded men. It's reported that Raymond and two other men got into an altercation with the security guard and knives came into play. When the brawl ended, Raymond was fatally stabbed and the security guard along with other with other two men wounded police have not yet ascertained the nature that started the dispute yaman yeah, reviewers beer yeah. chaos 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 so we have an updated story nephew still on the run after graveyard brawl in saint mary the St. Mary police are still searching for the nephew of 60-year-old Marvin Watson who allegedly stabbed the elderly man to death on Sunday has the family gathered for a funeral. The five-year-old daughter of the man now on the run was being buried when according to sources a long-running dispute between two men spilled over into yet another argument. According to the police a knife was used to stab Watson in his chest he was rushed to the port maria hospital where he died while undergoing treatment his 37 year old nephew police said fled the scene ncb employee charge in multi-million dollar fraud an employee of the national commercial bank has been charged in connection with a million multi-million dollar fraud at its island largest commercial bank kedin thomas was charged with larceny offensive under the cybercrime action and Monday after a question and answer session with detectives from the fraud squad she set to appear in Senton Parish Court on Friday it is alleged that the 35 year old wealth advisor of the NCB Hawaii Reyes branch the Ochi Reyes branch removed US 30,000 or roughly 5 million from customers account between July and October last year. She reportedly forget the signature of the she fraud the signature of the customer on a debit instrument after which she debited his account and transfer funds to several accounts include hers she was arrested last week the bank is currently undertaking an audit and investors believe the amount of alleged fraud could increase at the end of this exercise the man the people my thief wicked wicked my viewers ncb bankman i tell them i say the bank are going with beer things my viewers but trust me, we're not going here now. So just continue to stay tuned. Continue to keep a notification on. Yeah, man. So just do what's right. Do the right thing. Watch, like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel. If you're new, leave a comment also. Because the more you like, the more you share the video, the more YouTube automatically recommend the video to other law abiding citizens, such as yourself. Bless up, my viewers.